Okay, we're testing my microphone to make sure that you can hear me. I'm eating a chicken sandwich right now. Yo, what is going on, everybody? I'm Candace Zone, and I'm here for episode number 15 now of our Detroit Tigers Rebuild series. And we are in the free agency period now after a stunner of a series against series forgive me against the texas rangers where we lost in the full five games after winning 105 games in the regular season now you might ask how do we improve our team because if you guys remember we have a stupid good rotation we are six deep possibly seven maybe even eight if you really want to stretch in the minors maybe even nine compared to some other teams the bullpen was lights out last year, aside from Jason Foley, who completely lost his role as a starter now. Or as the closer, forgive me. And we picked up more pieces like Tony Santian and Jojo Romero, who were stellar for us. Because of that, we um, offered arbitration to the four guys on your screen. We tendered contracts to quite literally everybody who needed one. And in free agency, as you can see on the right side of your screen there, that's right, Javi Baez. One year, 700 grand to be the starting shortstop this season. Uh, no, I'm just kidding. Uh, Yohan Duran just became a free agent after pitching with the Dodgers after being traded by the Twins. And now, a rule that I stated at the beginning of the year is we would not trade with inner division teams. Now, because he was dealt to the Dodgers, he is now Dodger property, according to his contract. And now, because he's a free agent, we threw the bag at him. Three years, 13 and a half for a closer is very expensive. But, I mean, it's Yohan Duran. I'd argue that when his elbow's intact, he's the best closer in baseball. And we land Yoan Duran, baby. That is unbelievable. Uh, that means it looks like we got, did we get Javi as well? I'm curious, cause, um, yep, he's down there, we got him. We are so freaking good. Going right through it, arbitration, free agency. Like, Ozzy Albies is still out here. He's going to go to the Yanks. No way the Braves let him go. That's unfortunate for those guys, but we're going to simulate to the end of free agency. Ozzy Albies to the Yanks. Kyle Wright to the Padres. Doval to the Phillies. Carlson to the A's. So he got his bag, but at what cost? You're going to go rot in Oakland for the next five seasons of your career. Extensions. Riley Green, whatever he wants. I don't care. 280? 245 over 7. And boom. Boom. We get Riley Green, because this will be it. He'll be a free agent. Wilmer, you ain't getting all that money, bro. Let's be honest. I'll do 15 and a half. No, I won't. Oh, maybe I will. If we can get him for... All right, we'll, wa we'll wait until the meter goes down. Oh, my gosh. Mega discount. All right, easy. We're similar to the regular season. I don't care about spring training. We're going to look at the starters. One, two, three, four, five, six. Ty Madden. Chad Bach does not need to be in the majors yet. Now, the problem with what they just did to me is they called up a guy who didn't need to be called up, and then they called up another guy. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven starters now. Three arms. And they put Tony Santion on waivers. Would it be worth it to try and pick up like some prospects here? We did it. Oh, did I just trade with the Twins? Oh, I'm going to fix our lineups for you guys because I just did a major shakeup to our roster. And then I'm going to get to simulating and I will probably see you guys at the All-Star break. So I will see you guys in one minute. All right, trade deadline is here. We are 64 and 33, 31 games over 500. The Twins are keeping good pace with us so far throughout the year. We'll take a look at the standings. In the East, we are better than everybody here. Obviously best in the Central, best in the West. So we're the best AL team. We are the best team in baseball by, what is that, four games at the most? Nobody else has eclipsed 60 wins yet. Riley Green is having a great season. Scoob has been stellar. Torque has been fantastic. RBIs are a little down, it looks like, but him and Riley are on good pace. Um, Shane Bieber has been fantastic. Colt Keith has been fantastic, leading us in home runs, actually. Jackson Job has been fantastic, even better somehow than last year, like way better. Willie Adamas has been fantastic again. Dylan Dingler has stepped up in a DH role slash um, platoon role between DH and catcher with William Contreras. So, home run derby. 
for the reveal now. Hopefully, we've got at least one guy. Colt Keith does have 29. Riley and Torque are both in the mid-20s. So, all right. We get Colt Keith. So that's what we're going to do is set the score. Is He is currently tied for the Major League lead in home runs. Because of that, the goal now is obviously win the Derby because I sold last time with Riley. So we are going to do our best. Ronald Acuna hit 18 in the first round. That's a little concerning. I haven't played MLB in a while. Evidence to me being late on a lob ball. Oh my gosh. There we go. That's early. Shh, oh. There we go. There's another. Nice. That's 16. Within one. To tie. That's a base hit up the middle. To tie. There we go. That short porch and right is helping. To advance. There we go. We clear... Ronald Acuna in the first round. Look at oh, look at that spray chart. Goodness gracious. Now we've got a big rest now. Pete Alonso hits 17, so we know we can beat him. That's another one. That's 13 there for us. Next pitch coming in. That'll be 14. It barely clears the fence. 15 now to right center field. Can we get 16 and 17 before the 30-second mark? We can get 16, that's for sure. 17. There's another. And to advance after hitting one 468 feet. That'll put us past Pete. Into the final, baby. We're getting Juan Soto or Brandon Marsh. 18 from Soto. We know we can do it. Number 12 coming up. That's another one. We're going to keep going until we don't hit one over. Ah, that might be the one. All right, timeout time. Seven shy of a home run derby victory. Oof, make it five shy. Four shy. Oof, three to go. Ah, oh, I might have got under it. All right, two to go. It's super short, I forget. One more homer. Boom. Ah, oh, short. Boom, there it is. Colt Keith pulls it off. And is your home run derby champ. There we go. He hits 469, 68, 67. He only lost a foot of distance with uh, each passing round. So we take home a home derby champ, finally. I didn't throw. We're going to skip the all-star game. I'm not worried about the draft picks. We're going to show you guys who our all-stars were. Tarek Skubal was your starter. Out of the pen, we had Yohan Duran, and that is it. Catching, we had nobody. First base, we had Torque. Colt Keith at second. Uh, damn, I thought we might get Willie. And Riley Green in right. Okay. So we escape with how many is that? One, two, three, four. Uh, what is that? Five? Riley Green, Colt Keith, Tarek Skubal, Yohan Duran, Spencer Torkelson. That is five all stars. That's a big showing for us. So that is going to do it for this episode. I want to thank you all so much for watching and I will see you on the next one. Peace.